this tutorial we'll write a java program to convert set to array in last video we converted an array to set and in this video we'll just reverse the process so let me import java.util.hash which means import all the stuff into the java.util library and i begin by creating a set object of string data type so we have set equals to new hash set okay and we add values to the set so i add let's say python and i add java and i add a c and i add c plus plus okay so we have created a set and we have added four uh, elements into it and then since we have to convert the set into an array of string because our set has a string so i'll create a string data type of array so we have our array equals to new string and i'll create the array of the same size as set so i'll say set dot size which means this will the array will be created of the same size as the set if set has the four elements array will also be created of the four uh, size and then we call set dot to add to array and we pass our array so this will basically set has a built-in function called to array so this will basically convert our array uh, this will basically convert our set into an array so finally we print it we say the array is and i print it by calling the uh, built-in function of arrays which is to string and i pass my array that's it let's run it and see if everything is fine and it works fine the array is java c plus plus c python so uh, what we have done is we have created a hash set uh, uh, into the variable called set of string data type then we have added four elements into it and then we have created an array of string data type of the same size of the set and then we have called an two array function of set and pass the array so this will basically convert our set into an array and store it into the variable that we have passed which is array and finally we are calling arrays dot two string and we are passing array to print it so that's it with this tutorial and i'll see you in next video with a new program